NASA has been studying the stars for decades, but one of the things you may not know is that NASA actually looks down on our planet too to learn more about what's happening here at home. Joining us now is Leslie Ott, a climate scientist with NASA. Leslie, you've been with NASA for a little bit more than 15 years, and NASA has been studying the planet for decades. What sort of observations have you and your team made over that time? NASA has been making observations of a lot of parameters for multiple decades. So things like vegetation, water vapor, ozone, that's been really important in helping us understand the baseline of the planet and how it's changing in recent years as, as uh, climate change progresses. But some of the newer data that we're getting are helping us better understand air pollution, better understand the sources and sinks of greenhouse gases, and really understand how the Earth functions as this very complex and interconnected system. Now, one of the things a lot of people talk about these kind of more bizarre weather systems, these bizarre weather patterns that I think the general public considers bizarre. But as a climate scientist, it, this is kind of what we're expecting to occur more often, correct? Yeah, that is correct. A lot of people are seeing this and thinking, hey, you know, is this particular storm related to climate change? It's always hard for us to tie any one particular event to climate change, but scientists have predicted for a number of decades that the way that we would experience climate change is through these changes in um, in extremes, the, the kind of weirding of the weather, that, as some people say. And so as we see these kinds of changes in extreme snowfall, extreme droughts, extreme heat waves, that's very consistent consistent with what we've expected from climate change. And unfortunately, we do expect more of that in the future as the planet continues to warm. NASA has collected all this data and all this information about the planet. Do you think people are surprised how much research NASA does about planet Earth? I think a lot of people don't know how much research we do about planet Earth. I think a lot of times people don't appreciate how much we do to study our home planet. I consider that one of, I consider it the most important ma uh, mission that, that NASA has, right? Because our data actually help people, help communities um, navigate a number of challenges. So I think one of the surprises is how much data there is, but also, hey, I didn't know NASA did that. You guys do stuff that's not studying Mars. We actually do a ton of work here on Earth.